on Mindful Life. Today we are on the music side of a Mindful Life piano and we are doing a very lovely um, inspiration Christian gospel song. It's called Falling in Love with Jesus by Jonathan Butler. We're going to dive right into the song here. Falling in love. Okay, we start out with a D flat minor seven second inversion. We have A flat, B, D flat and E over an A and an E in the bass. That's your falling. Falling in love with G. That G, that's a G major seven root position with an E in the bass and octaves. So we have G, B, D, and F sharp. Jesus. The sus from Jesus is an A seven third inversion. My thumb is playing the G and the A. My middle finger is on C sharp and my pinky is on E. And my left hand has A and E in the bass. So that whole falling in love with Jesus section goes like this. Falling in love with Jesus. And then we ha we're here. Falling in love with Jesus. Okay, so that whole second part of the falling in, falling in. That's a D major uh, uh, second inversion on the right hand, left hand. You have D A D, D A D. So you have A, C sharp, D and F sharp. Falling in love. Passing chord, B, E, and A over a D flat in the bass. Falling in love with G. This is a B minor seven, third inversion. A, B, D, F sharp with a B in the bass. And then sus, the sus from Jesus. The sus, that's Jesus is split up into three syllables. So here's G, here's a sus. So the, that, that, the sus from Jesus is B, D, E, F sharp, and G sharp with an E in the bass. So that's B, D, E, F sharp, and G sharp with an E in the bass. And then here's, that's a D flat seven second inversion with an F in the bass. So I'm playing A flat, B, D flat, and F with an E in the bass. So let's take the whole falling in love with Jesus, falling in love with Jesus. So we start here. Falling in love with G Jesus. And then we're here with, remember? Falling in love, passing chord with G Jesus. Falling, now here we are, falling in again is this this is an F sharp minor seven root position with an F sharp in the bass. So we have F sharp, A, C sharp, and E over an F sharp in the bass. F sharp, A, C sharp, and E with an F sharp in the bass. So falling in love with E. That's an E minor seven second inversion. So we have B, D, E, and G with an E in the bass. Z. That's an A nine. Actually, let's do this. So we're gonna make it really an. This is a, really an A nine, not an A add nine, but an A nine chord. So my thumb is on the G and the A. My index finger is on B. C sharp and E with an A and a bass. So let's go back through that section. Falling in love with Jesus. Now is the best thing I've ever done? Is the best thing I've ever, ever done. Okay, so let's go through that. Is the, okay, that's a D major. And let's add this to it. Let's say D major nine second inversion, D. As in dog, D major nine, second inversion. You have A, you have C sharp, D, E, and F sharp with a D in the bass. Again, that's A, C sharp, D, E, and F sharp with a D in the bass. 
This is C sharp minor, second inversion. All right. Uh, let's describe it like G sharp, B, C sharp, and E with a C sharp in the bass. This is B minor, seven, third inversion. So you have A, B, D, and F sharp over a B in the bass. Let's go through that section. Is the best thing I've ever, ever. Okay, so what, what I'm playing right here, I'm playing a B, D, E, F sharp and G sharp. That's an E chord. That's an E9 chord. And we have the seventh in there too, guys, okay? And then we're going to here on done. Done is just an A at nine. So it's A, B, C sharp, and E with an A in the bass. Is the best thing I've ever, ever done. And then we turn it with this. This is a D major seven, second inversion. So I'm playing A, C sharp, D, and F sharp with an E in the bass. My bad. You see that? Let's keep it like that. So. That's your D second inversion, D major seven second inversion, and just straight to an E chord. Right there, G sharp, B and E over an E bass. Is the best thing I've ever, ever done. And then we go, that just sets you up to start, to start it all over again. Okay, now some of those inversions you can flip you don't have to do a second inversion, you can do a first inversion, whatever, depending on the mood and the voicings that you want. But those are the chords. Now, a, a quick note, as you notice, I described some of the black keys in terms of flats or sharp. I flipped in between because these black keys have two different names. That's also good for you all to, those of you who are still learning keys names, you'll understand that this is G sharp or A flat. All right, so that's Falling in Love with Jesus. It's a very beautiful song to play. Works in a variety of contexts, all right? All right, that's it for Mindful Life. Peace out. I press my way